this will probably be my last one for the evening because I'm, I'm, I'm out. Like I'm, I'm tired, late. Um, we've done like three videos, two, vid I think two. We've done two videos. Um, and this will be our third. And um, I think we're just gonna get through this Mason Woods mission. And I think this one, because this one's gonna have like a lot of info in it. I'm, I can't push two uh levels like I did with Black Ops One in and in, in like a one of these videos just because they're so long there's a lot of there's a lot of depth to these levels um so that's what we're, we're just gonna stick it to one one level per episode i don't know how many levels are in this game i'll probably look that up tonight um to see like how long the series will be but yeah no i mean i'll stick with it because it's it's fun and there's a lot of details and um and that's something i just don't expect in a call of duty game so let's move onwards um Back into here, boom. Yeah, if you remember, we left off with Woods going back to that base where we that we saw in um Black Ops One, where I think actually um one of those dudes died, or he didn't die. We saw him in like the promo material. I don't know. Yeah, helicopter. Tundra and Di Diamati. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar fool you. The beach was kosher enough. He knows where all the bodies are buried. Hell, he buried half. Licks the cubs. Yeah, you're the expert in quiet. I'm a goddamn onion, Mason. You should know that. Yeah, that's the, uh... Good kill. Not bad. Let's keep moving. It took a long time for that. You take one, I'll get the other. Oh man, you are not on it. Shit, this looks dicey. But hey, it's good enough the reds. You go first. <sighs> yeah, I got both of those woods. I hope this too holds. slow. You were too slow. That's done, boys. Oh, well, get it out like that. That's slow, yes. Oh, yeah, yoy. Hard to quick scope for that. Ah, uh, I didn't mean it. To... Make sure we grab that intel because there's a uh, one evidence. Do we want that? I mean, it is nice. Okay. Ah, we'll, we'll stick with this boy. Yeah, 
Well, I know there's a key and stuff in here too. Yeah, this is where you destroy the stuff from a. Uh... Wow. I think they said they're prepping the mainframe for extraction with a crane. We find the crane, we find the mainframe. Evidence, yes, for Red Circus. Huh. Crossbow bolt. Looks like Hudson had some fun here. Yeah, that's not how he remembers it. Try the stairwell. Well. How oh, the numbers? With the numbers. Make sure I find that key if there if it's up here. Hmm. Long way down. And that's where the thing collapsed because they're running that way. Uh, wow. Oh wait. Maybe it was here? I don't know. you the mainframe. Quack, quack. I have find my damn gun you're going first next time I'm not sure why I did that I see a down here. you'll have to find another way inside copy that station woods there's a zombies Easter egg here Great.
Okay, so this is where we find... That's pretty cool. Это место было заброшено после схода лавины. Я слышал, что при раскопках были найдены тела с пулевыми ранениями. Ты что? Хочешь сказать, что наши начальство скрыло вражескую атаку на советской земле? Лавины не стреляют в людей. Я люблю случаи. Нам пора идти. Ты что, боишься привидений? Я боюсь заблудиться и замерз нас насмерть, слушаю твои идиотские байки. Давай уже закругляться с собой. So long to knife one of them. It's not like multiplayer, you can knife a bunch of them. There's like definitely four guys. The место было заброшено после схода лавины. Я слышал, что при Ты что? Хочешь сказать, что наше начальство скрыло вражескую атаку на советской земле? Лавины не стреляют в людей. Я люблю в случае. Нам пора идти. Ты что, боишься привидений? Oh, Я проверю. Мне нужно подкрепление. Все чисто. There we go. They all dead. Noise. Some guns. I should definitely keep the knife. Now, I don't have to be quite as stealthy. We need to come back there though. I think I need a key. Разве здесь есть что-то важное? Не вижу ничего ценного.
this opens that weapons lock. Yeah, I read you. You gotta be close. Well, that's creepy. It's diner, some tapes. I got this cool pistol. Redeemer. I think this is a blueprint that maybe you unlock. I don't know. Kind of cool. Get all of them. I also know there's like another Easter egg. I'm curious how you get into that. Huh. Maybe you legit can't. the entire Soviet Union ain't up our ass. You've been busy. That's what they pay me for. In here, Chief. In there. map right. Swing a few degrees to your left, more north. There, what's that? Bingo. That crane matches the dick site on this map. That's gotta be it. We're digging for something. They be digging. Have you found the mainframe? There's a big crane on the west side of the base. Have your winch ready. Excuse me? My, my winch? Sorry, you're breaking up. <laughs> they got a crane, we got a chopper. I take this boy. I don't want the bow though. Nah. Mason, head down the cable. Fourth of July.
I'm in front wherever I you say come in. Sounds kind of fun. Magnum. I can actually hit my shots. Still just one shot at it. Cover me. Boy, you gotta stop saying cover me. I, I'm in front. Stuck on that pole. How did you get up there? to cover I 
made it. <laughs> Hudson. We finished analyzing that name frame that Mason Woods brought from Yamato. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleeper agents Dragovich used in 68. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus erased them. Fuck me. There's only one place you're gonna find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know. But we're gonna do this the right way. We're not gonna do it at all. Interesting. <laughs> I'm tired. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm just I'm, I zoned out for a second there. <laughs> um, yeah. No, that that is lit. That was a lit little little moment. I I was trying to find. There's a I think there's a zombies moment, but I missed it. I'm not sure if I missed it or couldn't find it. But just got word. Belikov is back in Moscow. You guys know the plan. All right, Lazar. Are you with you me? stepped it up Lazar, in your fit. Be ready for expel. Valerie you went back to you. Are you taking him into the KGB OG. with you? Are you crazy? Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Bell. He's got the skill we need. Are you enjoying this? You're risking the entire operation unnecessarily. It's not unnecessary. It's calculated. Just understand that if you botch this, we can't get those names. It's over. Okay. Interesting. I know you can do this. Hudson doesn't trust anyone he can't control. Oh, that new enlarger came in. I set it up in the dark before you. Dark, my girl. How you doing? Curious. Does the name? Madam Shell mean anything to you? Yeah. Sounds familiar. There's intel crisscrossing Arpanet that her body washed up along the Fideos River in Cyprus. Huh. That's so. And her head, two kilometers downstream. <laughs> Reports estimate her death around August of last year. Of all places. You were on assignment in Cyprus this past summer. Coincidence, wouldn't you say? Our line of work is full of coincidences. MI6 was keen on finding her. A rogue double agent gone dark for several years. I suppose she must have exposed herself somehow to the CIA. Leave behind a trail of heads, bound to get attention. I worked with Madame Michelle for three years, closely. I trusted her. But the moment I began to suspect something, she knew. I was able to fight her off, but... She left me with this parting gift. Oof. <laughs> That's a dirty gun. Right. So imagine my surprise when I read these reports. Madame Shell, body washed up on one bank. Head on the other. Ironic, wouldn't you say? I'd call it poetic justice. Lazar. <coughs> Thank you. For what?
Fuck, my mango, my mango, yo. Going to look at things? Okay. Let's do some talking. Let's do some chatting. What up? <coughs> Got COVID. Oh, I didn't expect to see you back here. And so let's ask about Hudson. There are people he'll never trust, and certain people he trusts impeccably. It just so happens you fall into the former category. I wouldn't dwell on it. Less is more. Less talking, less interaction, less commotion. Blend in. It's the last place they'll expect an intrusion, so they'll have that to your advantage. Pretty much everything else is at your disadvantage. That's true. Coordinating infill and exfil. We've had to move mountains to fashion an untraceable route to Lubyanka Square. I'll make sure that goes off without a hitch. Lubyanka Square. Getting you out, however, is another headache entirely. True. I've requested updated aerial reconnaissance to aid in planning your escape route. I don't want to run into any unknowns. Our path out of the Soviet Union will be anything but conventional. You know you're my main girl. <laughs> uh, I got a girlfriend though, so cool it. Hudson was leery about commingling with other intelligence agencies, but after President Reagan greenlit Adler's operation, he fell in line like a good little American patriot. Well, there you go. Remember when I warned you about inquiring into Adler's past? Some of that was likely projection. We're not always proud of ourselves. I believe there are better ways to embellish one's character. But in our line of work, it's often more important to diminish the impression we leave on people. Very true. I'll be here if you need me. I right, Park. I'll need you. Stay safe out there. Okay. Sure. All right. Speak to Lazar. He's got this new fit now, which I'm, I'm enjoying. It's time to break out your Russian, though. Well, she's... <laughs> you know what this dude thinks about Park. She's a true professional. I don't trust anyone at first, but after Berlin, I realize she's the real deal. Park's one of the guys to me. <laughs> One of the guys, my ass. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Listen, Lazar. He likes Bell. Gonna be honest. I mean, <laughs> hell no. KGB headquarters. Just between you and me. And me. And Sims. I hope I never get closer than pulling up in a car and picking you up. This has every chance of going tits down. Up. Man, tits up. Up, down, what's the difference? Yep, it's a long way to Moscow. Lazar, I think you're going on me a little. Can't tell if you're from like New York. Nope. Nope, what do you? Don't touch my legs. God damn it. Fine. What up, Hudson? Have you come to convince me that you should be headlining this operation? The long and short of it is that you're the wrong person for this op. I hope you prove me 110% wrong on this. Negative. Digging into the KGB's most classified database would blow his cover and burn years of posturing. He'll get you in, mm. but it won't go near that list of names. Mm. That's on a need-to-know basis. And from where I'm standing, there's no reason in hell you need to know that. You're to make contact with him and follow Adler's lead. I think the guy who does Hudson is probably the best of the like, returning cast people. We can't take the time to fabricate them. Belikov will get you uniforms, and from there you'll need to improvise. Strategically speaking, this board is on insanity, which is precisely the type of work we rely on Adler for. Mm. Either as Adler's most trusted ally, or as cannon fodder. An excellent proposition. 
All right, all right, Hatsune. Punch his punching bag. No, okay. Well, no evidence. Well, <laughs> oh, let's be cap. What's on your mind? This isn't the first government agency I've broken into. The best are virtually impenetrable. But there's always a weakness. Nope. In this case, the weakness is the KGB placing too much trust in one of their own. If there was ever an operation suited to your skill set, it's this one. I handle the talking, you get us the names. Why do you ask? I wouldn't tell you if it wasn't. He's a smooth talker, I'll tell him that. Scar? You mean this? Is it noticeable? <laughs> you know what they say about kids falling in with a bad crowd? Well, let's just say I fell in with the worst part of the bad crowd. The girl wasn't worth it, believe me. I don't. He's not one of mine. If I couldn't put my life in the hands of vetted strangers, I'd be in a different line of work. Hmm. Got a point. No. MI6 focuses mainly on the perimeter. Agents and client states. Smaller figures within the USSR. They go from the outside in. Belikov is one of ours, supposedly. I'm trusting Hudson here. The man can be a pain in the ass, but he's no fool. There you go. Okay. Well, with that, all that information, <laughs> I know that's an exciting end to uh, an episode, but uh, there's some more that we've got to dive into. I don't want to think too long. Oh my gosh. I said it's late. It's like 4 a.m. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that is part three. I don't know. Um, but I, yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this series. If you are, leave a like. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think of the series so far. Tell me. Did you see the numbers? Tell me what the numbers mean. Tell me what the numbers mean. No, um, but yeah, no, just leave a comment. Tell me what you're enjoying about this far. Tell me anything you want want to say. Say anything. I'm, I'm, I'd be, I'd love that. And subscribe if you want to follow more of this series. Yeah. My, more of my content. Got more things along the way. Have you been watching The Mandalorian? Tell me that. Because I've got I've got a build for that re coming up. Um, I don't want to spoil anything. So I'm not going to say anything. But hopefully you've been watching The Mandalorian. Um, yeah. Subscribe. Leave a like. Comment. And I will see you in the next video. Peace. Peace.